What is confirmed disability improvement? I'm going to explain that right now. Howdy, Aaron Boster here with the Ohio Health MS Center, speaking to you today about confirmed disability improvement, or CDI in multiple sclerosis. If this is your first time joining us on the channel, hey, thanks for coming, I hope you enjoy it. Please subscribe down below and click the notifications button so you can keep up on all the new and upcoming content. Confirmed Disability Improvement, or CDI, is a novel outcome measure that's been studied in recent MS clinical trials. It's defined as a one-point improvement on the EDSS scale that's maintained for either three or six months time period, uh, depending on the trial. It's a dynamic variable, meaning someone can have an improvement and then later they can get worse again. Now let's take it a step further. When we talk about the scale, we're talking about the expanded disability status scale. So I'll throw it up here. And it's a, a scale where we do a neurological examination and we turn the exam into a number uh, zero through 10. Zero is there's nothing neurologically wrong. I could run and jump and skip and play. And 10 is dead from MS. Now, it's not a linear scale, meaning the distance between zero and one is not the same distance as say five to six. And a typical benchmark is six, which is using a cane on the EDSS. All right. Now, in normal um, clinical trials leading up until only very recently, a typical outcome measure was CDP, confirmed disability progression. And they would measure the amount of worsening on the EDSS scale from the beginning of the trial to the end. So they would look at a group of patients that were receiving a given uh, experimental drug and say that in the start of the trial, on average, they were EDSS-3, and when the trial ended, on average, they were EDSS-5. And I made that up, just an example of worsening. Now, when you say confirmed worsening, what that means is I do an exam at time point zero and there's something newly wrong with you. I can see it on your examination. Your exam's not as good as it used to be. And then at either say three or six months later, I redo my exam and you still have that same problem. So the worsening is confirmed over a period of say three or six months. Now CDI, confirmed disability improvement, uses the exact same scale, the EDSS. But what we're seeing is that we're improving. So someone who started the trial at five for a period of time got better to a four and at least maintained that for three to six months. And there you have it, confirmed disability improvement. What is in my opinion, one of the most amazing and wonderful outcome measures we could ever talk about in the setting of multiple sclerosis. People actually getting better. I wanna hear your thoughts. Please leave your comments below and tell me what you think about CDI uh, and about these novel new metrics.